Select primitive add function in the toolbar here. Press and hold left click to create the first surface and click a second time for death. The primitive add function is a new tool which is currently under development in Blender 2.91 alpha. You find this tool in the toolbar in object and edit mode here. Primitive add is some kind of a freestyle tool which lets you create primitives with two clicks and without any menu or shortcuts, at least at the beginning. Just to make it clear, I have the left mouse button for selection and right mouse button for the context menu. Enable the tool by clicking here and go to the 3D viewport now. Click and hold the left mouse button to create the base or top surface. In this example the X and Y direction. Release the mouse button if you are happy with the shape. But it's not done yet and you have to move the mouse to create the depth direction, here the set direction. Click again for execution. And your primitive cube is placed. Reference point for creation is the position where you hovered your mouse at the beginning before you click. The reference point is always the grid surface till you hover other objects or edit any settings. When you hover other objects then the tool takes the orientation of the hovered face on click. It is possible to modify this point and I will show you how in this video a little bit later. If you press the shift key while adding your primitive, then you automatically create a square. This is working for surface or depth creation. Press control button while creating your primitive if you want to snap to a specific edge or vertex of existing objects. The alt button is only useful during step 1 and step 2. Press the ALT button while you set the surface or depth of your primitive. Then your reference point will be the center of the object. Press CONTROL button to snap to a specific vertex. Now press left click and release the CONTROL button, but press the ALT and SHIFT button. Release all buttons to finish step 1 of creation the surface. Switch primitive by keep left mouse button pressed on the tool icon primitive add in the toolbar and release it on your wanted primitive icon. It is possible to change depth direction in the top menu here, which is the second step of creation. So far we pulled it into the set direction, but now you are able to pull it as well to the X or epsilon direction. The second interesting function is the origin setting here, where you can select base or center. This option is more or less the same as pressing alt while you're in base mode. When center is selected, then you actually switch to base mode when you press alt now. It is as well possible to select orientation here and enable snapping as well here. When you switch to primitive selection then it is as well possible to set vertices, segments or rings here for your next primitive creation. And probably I wouldn't use the property settings panel after your creation, for alpha version. For sure you can change your values, but somehow this influences your next primitive creations as well and this is not very logical for me. Maybe this will be fixed when 2.91 is published, or it should be like this. I don't know yet. Well that's it for now, thank you very much for watching. It would be very nice to give this video a like and or subscribe to our YouTube channel for more game dev videos. Cheers!